Good morning, world. One of the complaints that many couples therapists have is that clients often wait until it's too late to come in. It's almost like they come to therapy as a pit stop on the way to the divorce lawyer. And of course, at that time, the, re, um, the expectations are so unrealistic. It makes it difficult for them to actually get things done. And that's why today we're talking about five things that couples therapy cannot do for your relationship. One is change your spouse because Therapy is supposed to help you see things as they are and help you gain the tools, help you learn the tools to fix them if they are not the way you want them to be. So you cannot come to therapy hoping that therapy will change someone. Therapy will give them the tools to change if they want to, if they are willing to put in the work. Therapy will help them see things that may not be quite as right and if they choose to, then they will get the, they will fix them with, with the skills that they will gain from therapy. Two, therapy cannot make your partner love you. If you are in a relationship where the love is not there, whether the love was there before or the love was never there, if the other person is not willing, does not want to, does not feel the desire to love you, Therapy cannot make that person love you. Therapy can help them see the good in you. They, they can, it can help them see the lovable piece of you. It can remind them of the reasons, the ways, and all the things about you that they once loved. But therapy, it does not have, there's no magic wand that your therapist has that's going to say, husband, love your wife, or wife, love your husband. Because it's good. Love is a choice and it's a choice that the person is going to have to make with the resources that is that are available to them. And of course, therapy can provide many resources that can lead to a person rekindling love or starting to experience love. But therapy is not going to make a person love you if they do not want to, if they do not already feel it, and if they do not have the desire to. Three, therapy cannot fix your relationship for you. Therapy will give you the skills again. It's like a mirror with a built-in coach. It exposes you to what is going on, what may be wrong, what may be um, in a way that you don't quite like. And then with that knowledge, with that exposure, your therapist will help you build and develop the skills, the tools that you need in order to fix all those things that you may not like, all those things that you may want to change. Your therapist will help you learn the skills. Your therapist will coach you through the process, but your therapist cannot do the work for you because as, as I always say, the therapist is there one hour per week. And it, even if you are seeing them three times a week, you have the rest of the day, a whole bunch of time that you and your spouse have together where you, you have to do the work to implement the things that you are learning for. Therapy cannot undo your past. Things that happened in your past will hurt you. But the goal of therapy is to help you cope, help you learn to move past those things. It's not going to necessarily make you forget. But what you will do is with the skills that you're learning, with the knowledge that you're gaining from therapy, you will be able to learn ways to manage, to deal, to move beyond what has happened in the past so that you can move to uh, focus on the future that you guys have together. And finally, therapy cannot bring the bliss back overnight. If you, if you pay attention, you will notice that the issues in your marriage, in your relationship that led to you coming to therapy have been developing over several years, several months, or however long. You cannot realistically expect that you're going to come to therapy today and all of a sudden things will be all happy just as they were before or just as you would like them to be. It's a process, it's a journey, and you and your spouse or your partner, your whoever, are going to have to work together to make it happen. It's not going to change overnight, but it can and it will change if you are both willing to make the investment of time, effort to make it work. Quick recap. One, therapy cannot change your spouse. You picked him or her, now you have to learn to deal with him or her. They can make changes, they can make improvements to their behaviors that will make the relationship better, that can make the relationship stronger, but therapy can only give them the skills to make these changes. Therapy cannot change them. Two, make your partner love you. If the love is not there, if the person is not interested, if the person does not want to 
take the time, put the uh, effort into loving you. Unfortunately, therapy cannot do that for you. Therapy can only give them the ac access to that lovable you, to help them see the lovable part, to help them rekindle, rem maybe remind them of why they loved you, but therapy cannot just make them love you. Three, therapy cannot fix the relationship for you. It is something that you and your partner will have to do together. Unfortunately, the therapist can help, they can give you the skills, they can give you resources, but they cannot do the work for you. Therapy will not undo your past, your past because your past is part of your history. It's there. No matter what you do, it's always going to be there. Therapy will help you learn to deal with, cope with, get past, move forward from that point. And of course, finally, therapy will not bring the bliss overnight. It took you several years to develop the issues that have brought you to counseling. And it's going to take a little bit of time for you to um, eliminate those issues, for you to grow past those issues and develop the skills to, you know, move to a better relationship. But you cannot expect it to happen overnight. And that is pretty much it for today. Good morning, world. Have a great day.